Everyone has a friend during each stage of life, but only the lucky ones have the same friend in all stages of life. I am one of the lucky ones. I've known Brad for a long time and Jesse only more recently, but there's one thing I know, these two are peas in a pod. each other from the first glance of acquaintance to this point of commitment. At some point, you decided to marry. All those conversations that were held riding in a car, or over a meal, or during long walks, all those sentences that began with, when we're married, and continue with, I will, and you will, and we will, those late night talks that included someday and somehow and maybe, and all those promises that are unspoken matters of the heart. All these common things and more are the real process of a wedding. The symbolic vows that you are about to make are a way of saying to one another, you know all those things we promised and hoped and dreamed? Well, I meant it all, every word. not finding somebody that you can live with, but marriage is finding somebody you can't live without. And I think you both have found that person. The truth is, as soon as I met Brad, I understood why Jesse liked him so much. He's sweet, smart, and hilarious. As I got to know Brad even more, I was able to witness his devotion to his family and friends. To me, this is telling of how he will love and care for the girls so many of us here adore. Who are such an amazingly wonderful people that the two of you together wasn't an if, it was a when, but we are all so glad that that when is now.